Hi guys, hope you're all doing well. Today I have a Waitrose haul to share with you. Um, it's so cold and I feel very congested, so if my voice sounds funny, I apologise. I'm just a bit, if that makes sense. Um, I had four substitutions, we kept them all. Um, I ordered potato dolphin moi, they substituted that for mash. Uh, I ordered a fish pie, they substituted that for battered haddock. Not the same, but it will work, I can make it work. Um, I ordered a cherry tart, they uh, substituted it for a lemon one, which I can't eat, but John will enjoy. Um, and I ordered some cauliflower and broccoli three cheese gratin, and they subbed that for a veg melody, medley, 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 which is probably the most disappointing substitute. But it will do. Everything else is what we ordered. I'm going to jump right in and show you what I got. And there we go. That is the overview. The party rings well, did not come today. They have been opened. Uh, we got four of these, but three have been put away already. So I've got four Coke Zeros. There are three bags of pretzels because they were on offer. Uh, we got some salmon paste mushrooms two packets of two packets two bunches of daffodils that is a loaf of white bread under there got some rice pudding a big soup in beef and vegetable yum uh, we got one bag of the proper sea salt lentil chips two carrots which were been carried in from the delivery driver and went carrots they taste terrible <laughs> He really likes carrots. So yeah, he announced to the delivery driver that carrots taste terrible. Um, some watermelon fizzies, sweeties, and some strawberry laces. Uh, some paracetamol and some ibuprofen. Uh, we've had these ones a couple of times now. John really likes them. I like them too. They're like these little cinnamon um, cakey roll things. They're really yummy. Avocados. I am a millennial. What can I say? Um, these were on offer, so I did fancy them. So I got some the Fitties Mint Club biscuits. John used to love a gold bar. Um, and then the malted milk, milk chocolate malted milk biscuits. Uh, this stuff is lush. Philadelphia Intense Garlic and Herbs. 100% recommend. It's so yum. Um, we got some bananas. We got some of the little mini... Easter egg things. Down well. Bananas. Oh, there's another one. Do, do, do. Another one bites the dust. Uh, we got some of these essential fairy cakes. They're just, um, they normally have a really good date on it. So today is the 12th. He's got the 28th on them. Um, so they last ages. They stay soft. Uh, I've got shop bought butter cream to go on top of them i thought it might be a nice thing to do with reuben saturday afternoon maybe sunday john's away this weekend so yeah just trying thought that'd be quite cute and fun for us to do together um but if reuben doesn't fancy doing cakes and things it's not like i've bought all the ingredients and they'll go to waste because this stuff lasts for ages uh we got some uh, red cabbage this is my substitution for a broccoli blooming gratin. Devastating. It'll do. It'll do. Mashed potato. That's my... It's giant, the substitution. Like, that's going to be some huge pieces of fish. Absolutely huge pieces of fish in a box like that. The box is super heavy. But yeah, it was meant to be a fish pie. Um, and then one of the nights that John's away, I thought I would give this a go. So it's the Lazy Vegan Tikka Masala. So it's vegetable, rice, um, in the chicken style pieces, in a tikka flavouring. Give that a go. Pancakes for Reuben, he really likes those. Some little red apples, again, Reuben loves those. This ham hock. I don't know how I first started getting this because it doesn't really show up on the website unless you search for it. Like if you just put in ham, it doesn't come up, but you have to put ham hock. Um, I think I might have got it as a substitution once. But now it's the best thing to chuck into like a risotto or when you're doing orzo 
in something like I imagine it'd be quite messy to put into a sandwich but for something that you're cooking with it's really cool um some skinny chips for Reuben a, oh I love this paella that they do it's so yum um these are the tarts that I can't eat that were a substitution but John will love them um some sausage rolls for Reuben's packed lunchbox the kids pizza some tender stem broccoli and green beans some tender stem broccoli and green beans a cucumber slow cooked duck yum that's gonna go with that red cabbage and some smoky barbecue pork shoulder i'm gonna do that with jacket potatoes i think egg custards for reuben the apple juice was on offer so we got that one some tubes for mr reuben that was the panna cotta that comes with the meal deal which was this one got one red onion and then back here got some cheese strings and some grated cathedral city And that is this week's groceries. I say it's a little bit of a hickledy pickledy week for us. So today's Tuesday. John's got a meeting tomorrow night, so tea needs to be a quick turnaround. And then John is away. I'm off work on Friday, and John is away Saturday and Sunday. Um, so yeah, it's a little bit hickledy pickledy, but I think we've got all our bases covered. Um, I'm just trying to focus on everyone being healthy. It just feels like we've been germy for so long. Um, but yeah, that is this week's food shop. I hope you're doing well. Take care, guys. I'll talk to you in the next one.